morning. It is like 9.30. I got up literally 20 minutes ago and we're headed to mass in five minutes. So I need to run. But um, yeah, I don't really have much plan for today. We have church and then we're going to brunch at my grandparents. But then when we get back, don't really know what the plan is. We'll okay. see. It's time to wrap presents. I grabbed a few things. I got this bag for my dad's these little boxes for my older siblings and my mom's and then I got this one for one of the twins I don't know how I'm gonna wrap the other one yet but I'm just gonna start today because I have to wrap all my dad's gifts to my mom and that's kind of a lot so I think I'm just gonna do my gifts today and then do his at a later date the end of the year everywhere on tv couples and christmas trees gift wrapping and cheer just the worst time to be with a someone special in all the movies there kissing in the snow holding okay so i got my family gifts wrapped today um, I, I started on the ones from my dad to my mom, but then I got really tired. It's like 3 p.m. I, while I was rapping, I listened to my Christmas audiobook. I'm almost halfway through now, and I'm really liking it. I like the rivalry going on. I like that it's a rivalry, but the characters very clearly don't hate each other. Because, like, you kind of get both in her monologue, and I'm like, okay, they don't hate each other. In fact, they feel bad that they're doing better than the other person right now. And I really like that. And it's super festive and Christmassy, and it's definitely getting me in the Christmas mood. Oh, also, I need to talk about this. Um, so last night I finished The Final Gambit, and to be honest, I wasn't really that impressed. So I gave the first book in the series a five stars. I don't remember much about the second book. I'm pretty sure I gave it a four. This one I'm giving like a solid three because the mystery was very predictable. Like. At first, it wasn't, but then when I got to about the 40% mark, I was like, oh, okay, I know exactly how this book is going to end, yada, yada, yada. So because it was so predictable, I took two whole stars off. Um, I also just thought that the dialogue got very repetitive. Like, I feel like Jameson and Avery had the same conversation in this book like six times, which kind of annoyed me. Um, but other than that, I did enjoy it. So I gave it a solid three. I'm trying to decide what to start next. These are the two books that I have left on my December TBR, Hang the Moon and Rule of Wolves. I'm leaning towards Hang the Moon um, just because Rule of Wolves is like very daunting right now and I don't want to go into a slump. So we're gonna pick up Hang the Moon. I've been on a historical fiction kick. I don't know why. I've just always been in the mood to read those. So I think this is gonna be the next book that I start. This is set in Prohibition era Virginia. And I'm pretty excited about this. I've also decided that I'm going to merge today's vlog and tomorrow's vlog just because I was spending time with family today. So I didn't really film that much. And tomorrow I'm hopefully gonna redo my bookshelf. So that's gonna take up like a lot of vlog time. So I will see you tomorrow. The day has arrived. I am redoing my bookshelf. This has been a long time coming to quote Taylor Swift. Um, because as I showed you in my last vlog, it's looking pretty messy right now. Um, I'm also going to go through and just grab books that I'm unhauling and that I no longer want. Um, so it's kind of killing two birds with one stone. I don't know if I'm going to have time this week at all to drop off the books to half priced. Um, I'm hoping when I come back from vacation, I will make a trip to half priced and just drop off um, a bunch of the books that I don't want there. Um, but yeah, so I'm thinking of starting A's down here because I feel like once we get to kind of the lower end of the alphabet, I don't really reach for those books as much. So that's what I'm hoping to accomplish today. So let's go. 
Also, I'm going to be listening to my Christmas audiobook while I do this because I'm like 50% of the way through and I'm really liking it right now. Um, I honestly thought it was going to be kind of mid, but I'm like pretty invested. So we'll see if I finish it today. I'm going to try to finish it today um, because I have another one that I um, got from Spotify that I also really want to listen to. So we'll see. <laughs> Okay, hey, y'all this is the final look so these i know i have more agatha christie's at school so when i bring those back on spring break i'm gonna add those in but these are all like my a's b's and c's um i also am still missing my six of crows copy and then i haven't finished rule of wolves yet so that's gonna go in my lee bardugo section um my older sibling is currently borrowing my six of crows copy so that's why that's missing and then this shelf is the rest of C's, D's, uh, G's, H's, J's, and K's. Um, it was a little bit tricky with these three books here because they're so heavy and big that they couldn't like stand up. So I had to like figure out how to do that. Same with these books. Um, I think this shelf is actually my favorite. I really like how it looks. I'm actually gonna move this candle because it's kind of bothering me the way that it's placed. There we go. I really like how that shelf looks. I think the composition of that looks really good. This shelf was tricky because I basically couldn't stand up any books like this. It's too small of a shelf. So I had to put them all like this. So I have all of my scythe books together. I kind of flubbed the alphabet a little bit because I wanted all of my Rachel Lynn books to be on one stack. Um, so those are all on one stack. And then these are just like miscellaneous S's. And then these are like W, Z, things like that so this is a little bit flubbed and then the top I still don't know what to do with the top I have like a bunch of stuff on there right now but I just I don't really like how that looks so I might end up putting more books up there eventually but for now this is what it looks like Hey guys, I'm home from work and I don't really have anything else planned for the day so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here um please subscribe so you don't miss more content from me give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and check out my social medias in the description box below and i will see you guys tomorrow Bye.